here in the private institutions watoto wetu walimekuwa wanarudi shule akirudi shule kazi yake ni kukaa anagojea asubuhi saa sita akiwachiliwa saa saba mtoto wako na njaa ukimwambia rudi shule tena kesi watakubali sasa ndiyo mnakumbuka i want to remind you all of you na mimi nilisoma kwa shule kama hii ya raia wakati nilisoma hapa kwetu Kiambu mtoto anapelekwa shuleni na kiboko na mama ama na baba ama namna gani jameni na sio kiboko ndiyo inapeleka watoto shule sababu ya kupeleka mtoto kiboko na shule shuleni is because you are removing that child from a home she or he loves mahali ambapo anachungwa vizuri na mama anapewa kauji asubuhi anapewa chakula mzuri alafu unampeleka kwa mahali ngine unaita darasa ambayo hata wewe mwenyewe as a parent hawezi kukaa ndani kwa vile mahali hakuna madirisha hakuna sakafu mahali hata hakuna kwingine hakuna mabati tuko na picha zingine za mashule ambazo tumebadilisha some that we changed that imekuwa ni mashule hata wewe ukiona unaaibika ya zile mbao zimeoza na mambo kama hayo alafu sasa hapo ndiyo tulikuwa tunapeleka watoto tulibadilisha tukasema la mwanzo under our program of renewing the education plan for all our young learners in ECD classes mtoto yeyote when they get to school the first thing kwa siku zao tano za kusoma every week kila mtoto akifika shule anapata amekewa amewekewa bakuli kubwa nzuri ama kikobe ya uji ya vitamin ile tunaita fortified uji and that is what our kids are having every day they get a cup or a bowl of porridge enriched with vitamins two tukasema mtoto yote akifika 3 days in a week 3 days in a week mtoto hata kama ma, kama mama yake hana kuku ama hata auntie yake hana kuku every child anapata mayai mzuri imechemshwa kila siku for 3 days akifika mtoto anakula mayai anafurahia We said for the nutrition of a child to be optimum lazima tuhakikishe kwamba that girl or that boy at that age anapata kikombe ama pakiti ya maziwa kwa vile hiyo ndiyo ile lishe ambayo inayofaa kwa kupatia yule mtoto nutrition ile anayofaa hapa kwetu sasa kiambu tukaongeza kwa huu utaratibu every Thursday morning watoto wanapata kila mtoto packet ya maziwa all the 40000 children every thursday na tupatiani maziwa tu hivi hivi hatupeani maziwa hivi hivi we ensure that that is milk that is good for the child and the children love it hii maziwa tumesema inaweka hata ka flavor mzuri unapata kuna maziwa ya, va, ya vanilla kuna ingine ya strawberry sasa watoto wanakuwa wanagojea maziwa na anaipenda so nataka niseme ya kwamba kwa huo muunganisho hayo mambo sasa tukauliza hatua ya tatu ni gani to make sure that all our kids go back to school and they enjoy being in school tukasema sasa tena wacha tubadilishe hii hali ya madarasa zetu ambayo tutaona siku ya leo tukifungua and for all all our 524 primary schools in Kiambu county no primary school public primary school had taken the initiative or the effort to make sure that they have constructed new good agreeable amiable learning centers the ecd centers mimi nikasema tutaanza wengine wakafikiri ni safari ambayo haitamalizika i remember when i said this the first time na nikasema we are advertising kwanza kujenga all the 524 schools wengine walifikiri governor tulichagua wewe governor hatukusema angaliwe kama hako sawa sawa. Hizi vitu wanasema they are not possible. Tukaanzia. Nikasema let us build the first 109 centers at the same time. Sasa today wakati nyinyi mko hapa wanakiambu wana wenzangu our sponsors my friends today we have built to completion total completion 109 complete ECD centers and you will see you will see how the ECD center looks like it is not a classroom it is a whole center tutatembea hapa pamoja and we will be able to exhibit this so that our parents can be encouraged to bring the children now to a good learning center where everything is available hii shule hapo tukienda pale 
mnaona ile mfano iko pale na tutatembea na nyinyi hapo kuna darasa mbili the first class is a pp1 class ambaye mtoto anatoka nyumbani anaenda anafika akiingia hapo ndio mahali ya kwanza kuingia ya pili pande hii ni darasa nyingine they are two in one hii ni darasa nyingine iko pande hii ile tunaita pp2 that pp2 ni ile darasa mtoto anaingia akitoka pp1 sasa ndio ataarishwe ndio ende class 1 hapo katikati that is where we have the teachers office which is fully furnished e, iko na meza iko na viti vya mwalimu na wageni wake ziko hapo ndani ya hiyo darasa sasa that means that that is a complete center lakini hiyo isitoshe ile kanyumba kadogo mnaona pale kanyumba kazuri maridadi that is the ablution block ama ni cho nzuri ya watoto wavulana wasichana na cho ya mwalimu ikiwa separate ndipo tunahakikisha kwamba hata hygiene tumeangalia hapa mbele mkiangalia mtaona kuna mahali ukiwa hapa haujui kama uko huko kanivo ama uko wapi ama uko huko huru park mahali ile mchezo vifaa vya mchezo vya watoto hufaa sasa hapa tuko na swings tuko na tunnel tuko na slides tuko na kila kitu hata ile merry go round iko hapa sasa mtoto akiwa hapa hata hana tamaa ya kwenda disneyland kwa vile tumeleta Disneyland hapa kwa public primary school. What we are saying is that we are serious to make sure that our children come to learn and not only learn in the old fashion. Hapa kwa hii darasa, hiyo darasa it is fully enabled for power. Ya kwamba hii darasa vile mmeelezwa hapa it is almost in the middle of nowhere. Nitasema nowhere kwa nini? Because hapa mahali tupo getiha hapa hakuna primary school yenye ilikuwa mbeleni ambapo tulikuwa tunakuja kuongeza darasa. Hii ilikuwa ni kiwanja tupu lakini tumeelezwa hapa na MCO hapa mpaka our chief officer. Watoto wa hapa Getiha ndio waende watafute masomo mtoto wa miaka sita miaka saba akienda nasari. Ani inabidi atoke hapa mpaka Gadangari kwenda kusoma Gadangari. Anatembea na mguu 5 kilometers na arudi nyumbani 5 kilometers. Na huyo mtoto ameenda shuleni na hata chakula hakuna wenye hawasomi huko wanaenda mahali tofauti tofauti that is why the same story we have repeated everywhere not only in primary schools but in every convenient place ambapo tunahakikisha kwamba watoto tunakata safari sasa watoto hapa hii area yote wako na mahali pazuri pa kusoma ndani ya hii darasa vile nilivyosema tumeiweka vifaa vyote hiyo darasa iko na tiles mzuri iko na ceiling iko na moto ama ile tunaita stima ya kwamba watoto sasa hapa ile inabakia ni kuhakikisha kwamba wote tumewaletea zile tablets za kusomea sasa mtoto hapa atakuwa nasoma kileo kimamboleo na kiteknolojia ndipo tuhakikisha kwamba mtoto hapa getiha anasoma pamoja na yule mtoto anasoma kule Nairobi kwa kanda ya Nairobi na sisi wote tunakuwa tumefananishwa tumetoshanishwa watoto wetu sasa wakiwa wanasoma hakuna siku mtoto wa hapa atakuwa anaenda kutafuta e, kazi ama shule ingine anaonekana kama mtoto wa mahali imerudi nyuma so nataka niseme ya kwamba hii kazi sisi ambayo tume, tumefanya tuko na haja na tumeipangia kumaliza nilisema mbeleni hivi ya kwamba leo tuna launch 109 centers as we speak tuko na another 130 schools yenye imejengwa inagojea kumalizika in the next two months that means that in another two months tutakuwa tumemaliza a total of 239 learning centers in the next two years tutakuwa tumemaliza all the 524 kazi ambaye haijawahi kufanywa hapa kwa Kiambu county tena na ndio tunasema tukiwa pamoja hii county yetu we are leaving no child behind regardless of background regardless of the well being or the financial capacity of their parents kila mtoto tunatembea naye safari moja to make sure that we change the destiny and the course of our people sasa msijiulize kwa nini miaka kumi kutoka leo ukitembea kwa hizi shopping centers zetu hapa Gedhongori kule Gedhega ukienda kule upande wa Kiambu town ukienda kule Gatondo ukienda kule Dhika hata wapi hata uende Kabete ama kule Lari mtajiuliza kwa nini vijana wanapungua kwa shopping centers wenye wamekuwa wanakaa kule masomo imeanza
akiwa mdogo na sasa anajua haja ya masomo msijiulize mbona kwa hii kaunti ya Kiambu kwa miaka ingine kumi utakuwa unatafuta watu ambao unataka kupatia kazi tu ya mkono watu wanakwambia wote wamesoma sasa sisi tunakuwa watu wa kuexport eh, teknolojia na masomo mazuri kwa hivyo nataka niseme hii kazi yetu imefanyika na tunamshukuru Mwenyezi Mungu hawa hawa sponsors wetu tunajua safari ile tumetembea pamoja nataka niwashukuru wenye mmetupatia eh, CPF wametupatia zaidi ya shilingi milion mbili ya kupatia watoto wetu hizo desk na zile viti ambazo watoto wanakalia tunawashukuru watu wetu wa lab fund hata hao wametusaidia kununua viti zingine na desk zingine watu wetu wa bata tunasema asanteni you have given us the footwear the shoes for our children we have 40000 children in learning centers that tells you tuko na safari mrefu ya kutembea sasa tutakuja kwenu tukiwa tuko na pesa na tena tutaleta tuta, tuta, tuta mkono tena tukinunua nyingine mtuongeze ama namna gani jameni kwa hiyo shule mmemwambiwa ya kwamba hapa tutakuwa tunapatia watoto wetu vitabu vya kusoma kwa hivyo sasa kutoka next time hakuna mtoto ananunuliwa vitabu vya kuandika na nyinyi wa, wazazi we have made that possible by december this year by december this year the county government will provide every child with a free uniform ya ya kutoma mtoto wa ECD na wote tuwafanya wakue watu wa kufanya kiambu to be great again ama namna gani jameni so sasa sisi tuko na imani ya kwamba hii county yetu tunabadilisha na kwa vile sitaki muulize mbona nilisema tunaenda kuona pamoja nataka tuende pamoja pale na wale wataweza tuhakikishe na tuweke ushuhuda ya kwamba darasa ni vile governor amesema kwa hivyo tutatembea pamoja pale tukate tape hapo tuone darasa vile ilivyo tukague ile pale zile ablution block alafu tukuje hapa nataka mzazi mmoja mwenye hajakula sana kama wa matangi tumweke pale kwa swing hata yeye tuone kama mzazi ataweza kuswing kidogo tutafuta mzazi mwingine ambaye pia hajakula sana tumweke kwa slide a slide na mtoto wake ama namna gani jameni sasa si twende pamoja pale na kwa vile kwa vile hata chief officer wetu wa education hajakula sana hata yeye aende aslide pale Mungu awabariki watende vyema asanteni twende pale tumalize hii kazi asante thank you Asante sana ya excellence ningeomba kwa heshima tu tafadhali tutapatia governor nafasi deputy governor speak and partners tutawapatia nafasi ya kwanza waingie ndani kwa hivyo tafadhali tu kwa heshima tu Dr. Masi na wazazi kadhaa watoto kadhaa tafadhali mama hapa mama hapa kila mtu ashikilie hapo in 3 okay in 3 2 and 1 congratulations 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 tutoa kwa heshima tu governor speaker our partners na few waheshimiwa wetu waingie tu
Take you on two. Take you on two. So check. Check you on two. So check. Check one two. Check one, two. So check. 